Hey guys, Emily from Create86 here. Tonight I'm doing my 2016 personal domino setup. So, not a lot has changed. And, well, it's changed a little bit, but nothing crazy. It's now more of a home binder than it is a personal carry. I do not really take this out of the house. Oh, there's like some little marks on it. I'm not sure where those are from. Anyways, so open it up. And I still have my page flags over here, my paper clips, and the only thing I added were some stamps back here. It's the only thing that's different right there. I hand cut this um, dashboard from Vellum from Michaels because I thought it was really cute for February. And oh, it didn't stick. And I put my new, Feb well, my old February dividers in because I think they're really cute. It's a red theme. Now this is monthly and weekly, but I no longer have a weekly in this. It's just the monthly. So here is my monthly. I thought these were super cute. These monthly pages are from a dollar, um, just throw in your bag planner from the Christmas tree shop around Christmas time. And so here's January, or here's February. And today is the 8th. And then it has different colors for each month. So here's like May, June, July, and so forth and so on. So this is my monthly. And it's just so I can mark the days off. Major events go in other planners and stuff like that, so. There's the monthly. Then I have this. This is, sorry guys if you're watching, <laughs> this is a health. It's for my period tracker. <laughs> it's not very eventful, but I track like how I'm feeling, how many days, that kind of stuff. And then I just have a bunch of these dollar spot pages, which are perfect because you don't have to cut them down. They're the perfect size. Then I have some Mombi um, cards. I've had them in here since the beginning, which is almost two years ago. There is nothing in this divider except for one post-it and like two page flags. <laughs> um, if you have an idea of what to put there, let me know in the comments down below. I would be very grateful for an idea. Um, so for this divider, it is a notes section, um, and it's my 100 and 1001, which is 100 things in 1001 days, and a lot of it has actually gotten finished. Anything that's crossed off, we've done. So there's a good amount of stuff that's done. And that's all personal stuff. And then I have this dashboard that came in a swap that I did. And it just makes a really good um, hard surface to write on if I need to take notes on something. I have the remainder of, these are actually hand cut uh, pages. And here is my sample that I made. These are just staples um, notepads that I cut down. And I just take them, a bunch of them when I get low and refill. And I have some of these dollar spot Note papers, I have a whole bunch punched already, so I just throw them in when I get low on paper. And then the leftover file effects paper. This is a finance section, which I cannot show you. And then this is my addresses, which I can't show you either. Um, <clears throat> and then this is my password section. This little cute doggy. He's so cute. And it's actually the front and back of a another pocket planner. So you can I'll show you the back of it. It's cute. That's what it looks like on the front too. Super cute. And I just put my passwords in between them. So it's not so obvious. And then I have my Ziploc bag with a couple reinforcements, stickers, Avery labels that I use for cell phone bill stickers and some Dollar Tree stickers and then um, this pen which I've had since I got the 
planner. So it's going on strong for two years. And that's about it. That's my home planner at the moment. Um, if you have any ideas for anything else that I could put in here, I don't really do meal planning at all because I work nine to six. So my mom does the cooking around here for now. Um, otherwise we'd be eating at 8.30 every night. And nobody likes that around here. So I guess anything but meal planning would be awesome if you have any ideas. And let me know down in the comments. Um, if you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button over there. Or it could be over there. <laughs> Alright guys, have a great night. Bye.